This is a game standards. Over 40,000 in attendance at the top of their lungs. Roadrunners into the backfield. Coming up, Lincoln. As he meets Nick Booker Brown, it's third down. And with a up the middle. It was four and out for the Bobcats looking for their first first down here in the dome. 25 yard line. Empty backfield for Finley. Hesitation and that'll from the 29 yard line. Second pass attempt of the day from the 6-7 quarterback. He's got Ashton Hawkins. Backers, they have to go ahead and apex split the difference between the tackle and the receiver allows more running. Is a backwards pass, trying to get to the edge. Great dual situation for T.J. Finley. Third and a short two, swatted Ken Robinson. Ken Robinson doing a... Behind that line, and this in the end. From the 43. And it'll be another for Finley has time, overthrows his. And just trying to hide behind. Run the ball immensely on this front seven. Third and a long six. Finley, pocket collapses. He is going with a little coverage. Finley's already converted on one fourth down. Airs it downfield of what was FCS and before that one double A for making the move from the Southland Conference to the WAC. And before UTSA could ever play, Texas State still calling the Sun Belt home. On second down, it's going to be thrown. Run the ball consistently against his front. You've got to throw the ball. Finley, pocket holds up. UTSA comes back in coverage. They run soft coverage. And guess what? They find Drew Donnelly right down the seam. It's up against the veteran. Finley with the option. Well timed. Well executed. Yeah, running the option. He simply just pitches the ball. And now he does the rest. Picks up a nice gain. Winds up being a first down. As of late. Try to see if they can get something going. They just got a big stop on the defense side of the ball. It's 10-0. You got eight minutes, 54 seconds. Lead left road runners. More than 70 newcomers, including 53 new scholarship athletes. That's almost like turning over an NFL roster. Forcing the incompletion. Pressure him and get that ball out quickly. Third and 10, empty backfield. They need the 45, and they're going to be just. But he was denied that chance when Houston did not have a fourth down staring at them at the end of the game. Instead, they were awarded a first down after the ball appeared to move multiple times. Obviously, Jeff Trailer feels like he let one get away, and he wants to make sure that he does not take any chances today against the Texas State Bobcats. He's up 10-0. He knows that this team just beat Baylor last week, had a phenomenal win, and now they're full to something else. Finley. They'll hand it off on first and 10. A receiving touchdown and exploding for a 65-yard run. Looked like early movement on the right side. Finley down the middle, too tall. PSA is going to back off and just rush with front four. Finley can pick it up with his legs and does. TJ Finley will... Ooh, that wasn't in my job description. Six-yard completion to Hawkins, but stopped at the line as... Finley, quick release, has his man and able to. Great play, UTSA running trap coverage, and T.J. Finley finds Drew Donnelly. T.J. Finley getting his Bobcats lined up, looking to punch in their first score of the day here at the Alamo Dome. We expect this will be confirmed for his second touchdown. We Look for something to the running back to start off a draw, a screen. Finley. Across the line of scrimmage, timeouts left for either team. Looking to the sideline, really the only way they can stop the clock, and they will. Finley down the middle, back to Donnelly. Clock runs this year. Another great throw by T.J. Finley, finding Donnelly running across the middle, in stride, on a strike, ball near midfield. 
50 seconds to go in the opening half. It's Hawkins. Down to the... Earlier in the game, now he is on target and on point. Looking downfield, just a tad... Again, he has not gotten back up with 32 seconds to go after this hit. And Lincoln now, it appears that we have a UTSA player and a Texas State player both down. Finley. And it'll be third and ten. Finley. And that's just who led Texas State to that tying score before halftime. This time, Owen, you already got the ball near midfield. Let's see what you can do with it. Waiting for his block. His Bobcats offense. Finley. All the time he needs, all the arm he needs. Who breaks it up at the end. That is a fantastic play by Pig Cage at the last second right there. Takes the swipe at the ball. And th There's a flag down before the... They'll play action. Finley throws behind his receiver in a long 14. From their own 48. Ball is swatted into the air. It's an incomplete. Jamori Robinson coming in off of the left side and simply doing his best J.J. Watt impersonation. Getting five. Beginning at their own 15. And it can now manageable where now you can simply run it or pass it. Wilson, five catches against Baylor last week, was at UIW last year, and now him is the running game. Finley will be met at the line. Of Play clock down to nine. Quickly to the left side, working through. This is a great play by Cam Alexander, beating the block and coming. Bentley has time. Look to them underneath. You can see on your screen right now, TJ Finley is surveying the field. It's only a four-man pass rush, but they're still getting penetration. They saw a bright future for San Marcos. And so Punch, you just got a touchdown thrown on you. How is your offense going to come back? Texas State apparently did not sub. They catch you. The Canadians aren't going to tolerate that. First and 10 from their 41. A little bit too much east. Lost midfield. For the next first down, Penley going the wrong way. And just like I was saying, UTSA comes with four people, and Trey Moore simply beats his tackle. All but he found a way. Penley steps up. Little shovel pass forward. Calvin Hill. Last week and had an interception. He stripped that one loose. Finley downfield drops it in. Finley will dump it down and nowhere to go. He'll throw it out the back of the end zone about yeah once again let's go ahead and take a look they're just rushing four people they're able to get penetration and pressure with just four and yes there is no way tj finley way you can make it a manageable fourth and goal finley under pressure just said that clock will not stop and this will not help spinning out of tackle They've already had one big play over the top. Finley hit from behind to get to the 39-yard line here on third down. Get rid of it in time into the backfield. 